Before the invention of short takeoff and vertical takeoff aircraft like F-35s and Harriers, Convair tried developing a propeller-driven fighter to achieve vertical takeoff. Meet XFY Pogo. Pogo's first test flight happened in August of 1954, but the plane only took off vertically and landed back. The first conversion from vertical to horizontal flight took place three months later in November. But after further testing, it was evident that Pogo had some problems. For example, the pilot had to look back behind themselves during landing to properly stabilize the aircraft, which only the most experienced pilots could do, rendering Pogo not feasible as previously hoped for to be on every ship. Also, jet engine fighters had top speeds that approached Mach 2, and Pogo was at a disadvantage with a top speed below Mach 1, so the program was eventually cancelled. Pogo's last flight took place in November of 1956, only two years after its first flight.